trailer is helping keep together the items needed for a new local nonprofit making its way to the Brazos Valley. It's filled with clothing racks, totes, boxes, and more. The Different Day Foundation is hosting a meet and greet at the Stella Hotel in Bryan Wednesday night. Marcy Bartula is the CEO. She believes that the public donating clothes is the first step towards recovery for survivors in the area. You can kind of see uh, what our program's about, who we are, and how we're coming to the community and be able to fill in some gaps. We want to make sure that they have dignity back at every every turn in their program. Brandy Lampo is helping get it all ready for Wednesday's event. She plays a major role in the organization and making it different than other support groups. There's no equine assistant therapy close. Horses are soothing and help with anxiety, according to Lampo. She says having these gentle giants in the area are all part of the healing process. To teach the girls how to build trust again and that connection with something that you have to just earn it. Although there are several volunteers and employees, Rose is a survivor leader. She hopes to assist the survivors in ways others might not be able to. She relates to them and says that will be beneficial when forming a deeper connection. I have seen different programs, different places, and I have personally been able to see what works and what doesn't. So in helping Marcy build this program, I can specifically say that this is, I mean, nothing's perfect, but it is definitely tailored mostly toward what can specifically help survivors. Providing free clothes and equine therapy to survivors is just the beginning for the Different Day Foundation. Marcy says there will be residential housing, gainful employment, and valuable life skills learned while in the program. Reporting in Bryan, Rachel Witter, KRHD News.